Hi there, this is Jill Woods from Crowd Connections, and this is a short video just to show you how to upload videos to your YouTube channel once it's been set up. Um, it's really simple. This is your or what your um, YouTube channel will look like with your feed and video tabs here. If you go across to the right hand side, you'll see your username in this box here and next to it a very small grey down arrow. If you click on that down arrow it gives you several options and the one we want is video manager. So click on video manager and that will take you to a screen that will look like this. If you haven't uploaded any videos before this section here obviously will be empty um, but over in the left hand side there's a button that says upload so we'll just click on the upload button and then select files from your computer. Um, I've just done a very short video here so hopefully it will upload very quickly so we'll select that. One thing just before I do that is just to note when you, um, before you upload your video try and rename it um, so it's something meaningful and include some of your keywords if possible as well um, so that it doesn't appear in the memory of, of YouTube just as a load of digits and, and code. Um, it's actually got some of your keywords in it. So once you've selected the video you want go to the open button at the bottom right hand corner which is just off the screen sorry click open and then it will start to upload um, while it's uploading you've got the choice here to put in a new title so I'm just going to call this test video as it quite clearly is a test video and then a description again when you're doing this your description wants to include some of your keywords um, and also the URL of your website so you need to put the full one in so it's http colon forward slash forward slash www dot um, and then your um, url so in this case www dot um, crowd connections dot com and then that's followed by a description of the video so this is a short test video to demonstrate how to upload videos to a YouTube channel. Okay, um, and again include as many keywords in there as you can. The description can be fairly long, it doesn't have to be just a sentence or two, it can be a couple of paragraphs. Um, and then down in the tags, again you want some of your keywords, so we'll put in here you, oops, yeah, YouTube and then separate them by a comma so then we'll put YouTube um, channel and then we'll put training video okay um, there we go so it, it does give you some um, options down here some presets that you can click on but as you can see some of them are a bit random the one it's given me here is funny which is not appropriate so we'll ignore it um, once your video is uploaded and it will take longer than this has done because this literally is a two or three second video so it gives you these three video thumbnails that you can choose from obviously these are all the same because it was such a short video um, but one of these you need to choose one of these just by clicking on it um, um, and that will set that image as the thumbnail that will appear on any search results within YouTube um, that show your video. Across on the right hand side, privacy settings, you want the public button clicked, category, now you've got to give it a category and they're very <laughs> very broad brush categories these. I tend to put mine under education because they all tend to be how-to videos so I'll put that under education and then you generally don't need to change that that's just the standard YouTube license you can leave that as it is and then scroll down to the bottom. It does auto save and so you can see here it says saved. Um, if I made another change over here um, you can see that changes to a blue button and you need to click it when it's blue to save changes. If it isn't blue, it's been saved. So I'll just get rid of that. Okay, so let's save changes. Um, and because this was such a short video, it's finished uploading it. So we go back to the top here and you can see it's already allocated as the URL where we can go and view the video. So we go to click on that URL. And that should, fingers crossed, take us to a page. There we go. Okay, this is just a short test video. There we go. So short test video 
and it's uploaded and if we scroll down you can see this was the description that we wrote which includes our URL which is now a clickable link if you just put www dot it doesn't create it as a clickable link you need to put the HTTP in as well um, uh, and that's it it really is that simple um, so I hope you found that video useful and um, please leave any questions or comments below and um, thank you very much for your time